Hey, what's going on guys? Jerry Glean back on the scene here with another video. Today, I'm gonna be showing y'all how to organize your VST plugins within FL Studio. So let's hop right in and get to it. So I have the mixer pulled up and on the right side here, you can see there's different slots for me to load VST plugins. And if I click on slot one, as you can see, I have my plugins organized based on the type of effect it is. So I have, um, for instance, distortion plugins under the distortion uh, folder. I have EQ, I have compressors. So I'm gonna show y'all how to set up um, your own folders. That way you can organize your plugins how you want to. What you need to do is you need to open up your documents folder and locate this folder called image line and then click on FL Studio presets and go to the plugin database. So this is where you're gonna name the folders that you want to put your plugins. So if you click on effects, you can see how I have mine set up. I have my compressors under the compressor folder. I have stereo imaging plugins underneath the stereo imaging. So as you begin to buy more plugins, you're gonna to wanna to be able to locate them um, quickly when you're mixing. So when I know what type of effect I want on a certain sound, I can find that plugin to do that effect very quickly. So in order to create a new folder, you just right click, hit new folder, and I'm gonna name it FL Studio Vid. So there's no plugins under this folder, so in order to get the plugin, you have to go copy it. So I'll go back. Under the installed folder is where all of your plugins will be. So you can see every plugin that I've downloaded um, is under here, and all you have to do is right click, copy, and go paste it in that folder that you just created. So when you go to FL Studio, you'll see that this works in real time. The FL Studio vid folder has already been updated and that plugin that I just copied and pasted in there is now located under that folder path. So guys, this works for instruments as well. The only difference would be that you're gonna be pasting it under generators instead of effects. And generators is just another word for instruments. So this is where all your instrument plugins are gonna be um, held at. So you would find whatever folder you wanna paste it under or you could create a new folder. All right, guys, I hope y'all learned something. If you have any questions at all, please leave a comment and I'm gonna try my best to get back to you and I'll see y'all in the next video.